Finally, another stolen car on fake plates. But attempts to avoid detection by hiding the true identity of the Fiat Punto have failed. Now Greater Manchester Police are on to them. They're wanted in connection with a burglary the previous year in Stockport, which is when this car was taken. The driver is trying to escape down a quiet residential street, paying little attention to the hazards around them. He then takes police round the houses as he tries desperately to give them the slip, but it's not going to be that easy. Once he's on the open road, he puts on some seriously dangerous speed and nearly collides with one car after another. And when he reaches a red light, well, it's not hard to guess what happens next. The near side lane is blocked by roadworks, but the driver doesn't simply ignore the warning signs, he flattens them. Back on clear roads, he suddenly makes the decision to take a detour back onto residential streets. Ignoring the speed restrictions, the driver meets another junction and, well, a distinct pattern is beginning to emerge. But what he doesn't know is that he's heading towards a dead end. This road leads nowhere except towards the police station in handcuffs. The driver was convicted of handling stolen goods, dangerous driving and driving whilst disqualified. He received a 12-month suspended sentence. Cloned plates weren't enough to hide this thief's string of offences.